uh, a million small business uh, loans uh, for African-American men and providing $20,000 of forgivable loans for black entrepreneurs to be able to start small businesses. Well, it must be crazy o'clock, boys, because that's where we're at. Kamala Harris just told a group of goofballs over here that Donald Trump is sending in the MAGA military. Hunt them down. He's going to look for all the blacks. Right? I'm going to blood test everybody. Who is 1 1024th Native American and or black? You're under arrest. You're being thrown into a MAGA FEMA internment concentration camp. And we're going to murder you to death and then force your dead body to have a baby. No, that that's not. No, we're just going to go to when Donald Trump wins the next day, we're just going to go to work. Maybe mow our lawn. Yeah, we're not we're not hunting anybody. Down. Like, this is ridiculous. But again, this is where we're at with leftism. And even though that third assassination attempt t- turned out to be a crazy California sheriff being crazy and he should be arrested, by the way. So we back down to only two known assassination attempts of Donald Trump. Well, that's how you get here. That's how you get here. You're not going to get any more votes out of this crazy rhetoric over here. Telling goofballs who are mentally ill over here who are already going to vote for you that Donald Trump is going to use the military to wrangle them up and then kill them is only meant to get the dude killed. It's only meant to get him killed. She's over here preaching to the TDS choir. They're already voting for you. Now you're just saying the world's most insane, inflammatory, dangerous rhetoric. And I wouldn't have a problem with it, by the way. But you guys keep arresting our side and saying, well, you guys are saying mean, dangerous rhetoric. So now you got to go into arrest. Okay, so then we're going to arrest you after. Yeah, a bunch of people are going to get rounded up by the military. You, you, the Obamas, the Clintons, you're all under arrest. You're criminals. We're going to arrest you. But yeah, no, none of this, none of this talk right here is meant to get more votes, right? From, from the side that gets votes from the dead and prints votes up. No, no, no. The way that they, they want to get the vote out is they'll just bribe fools. They just straight up bribing people at this point. And they're saying, hey, are you a black individual or brown? How much black do I have to be? How much brown do I have to be? I don't even know if this works for brown people. You might be out of luck, brown people. Asians, you definitely out of luck with this administration. No, we're giving out free cash money to only black dudes, by the way. What happened to the, what about the women? No, no, no. We're not losing ground with the black female voters, so we're not going to bribe them. We're just going to bribe dudes. Well, if you're not going to get a free bribe from this criminal government, you might need good old-fashioned financing from a sane place like American financing. Check them out in the link below. Today's economic environment is still really stressful for a lot of us, but the Fed finally dropping interest rates. There is no better time than right now to put you and your family in a better financial position. If you're a homeowner, American Financing is helping thousands of families just like you who have been putting everyday expenses on credit cards get out from underneath that debt by tapping into their home's equity. American Financing is saving their borrowers over $800 a month on average. $800 a month is like a $10,000 raise at work. And it costs absolutely nothing to find out how much you can save. They are closing some in as little as 10 days. And if you start today, you may not have to make next month's mortgage payment. There's no better time than right now to turn your situation around. Call today, 866-889-8010. That's 866-889-8010. Or visit AmericanFinancing.net slash salty. Now, if you're a marginalized individual from the left-hand side and a victimhood status, of course, well, you can just go to Kamala Harris and get free money. Wow, that's a weird thing. That seems, I don't know, illegal. Here's her uh, Kamala Harris. Black men deserve a president who cares about making their lives better. You go, you go fall for this again, black dudes? No. <laughs> no, that's the problem that they're having. That's the problem that Kamala Harris is having right now. Black dudes. Yeah, no, no. No, black dudes, uh, they're like, hold on a second. We had Obama. We had Obama 1.0, Obama 2.0. Then we had the white Obama with Joe Biden. Yeah, no, 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 no. The only thing that we got out of this was a bunch of mentally ill Antifa white liberal goofballs and black dudes in BLM shirts done burned down our neighborhoods. Yeah, and and then all of the money that BLM took in, all of the, the, the people running it, Stole the money, allegedly, of course, but bought a bunch of mansions. Patrice Kohler's, she got four mansions. Patrice Kohler's brother got a couple mansions. Patrice Kohler's cousins got mansions, man. That's weird how that works. Here's her policy, though. This time for cereals, black dudes. Free money! Cash money freebies! 
Kamala Harris will create an opportunity agenda for black men. Wow, it's weird how Asian dudes don't need this or brown dudes don't need this. Or the white dudes in the, the Appalachians don't need... No, no, just don't get anyway. anyway, she's going to provide $1 million loans. Provide $1 million loans. Sorry, $1 million loans. Who knows, boys? She's going to get real desperate. She'll do a quadrillion dollar loan. Provide one million loans that are fully forgivable up to two. I can't even read it because it's so insane. She's going to give a million twenty thousand dollar loans that are totally forgivable if your skin color is black. Now, you talking Michael Jackson, nineteen ninety eight black, or are you talking Don Cheadle black? I don't know. I'm going to need a. I'm going to need a whole card over here. I need a spectrum. But they're they're forgivable. So it's just. $20,000 free, kind of if you're black. She's going to support education, training, and mentorship programs that lead good paying jobs for black men. You mean black jobs? Thought that was racist. Pathways to become teachers. Yeah, we need more of these teachers. Nobody can read in this country. They can't read, they can't write, they can't solve for X. Let's get more of these teachers. Idiots. Protect cryptocurrency investments so black men who make them know their money and say, I know who I am. So there's a lot of racism in the crypto world, boys? Oh, those are crypto bankers constantly out there lying and stealing from access people. Not that, what, what are you talking? Oh, I got the monocle. I got the monocle. It's going to launch a national health initiative focused on illnesses that disproportionately impact black men. Yeah, that's called... McDonald's diabetes. And then, this is my, so here's how this all boils down, by the way. This is, this is, this, hey, black dudes, free money and weed. I swear to God, this is the most racist administration of all time. Legalize recreational marijuana to create opportunities for black Americans to succeed in this new industry. Free money and weed. Blacks now vote for me. That chick's panicked. That chick's panicking, but there you go. Um, it's a bold strategy. Let's see how it plays out because it's not working out real well. Now, Donald, that, she's doing this because she's lost the black vote. Now, these black dudes watched Antifa and BLM burn down their neighborhoods, so they're kind of done at this point. They're on the Trump train. Let's make America great again, boys. Thank you so much for watching the video. This point channel kept up to date on these straight-up bribes. Hit that subscribe button and make way because the salt must flow.